Hello, my name is Aisha Mehdi. I was born and raised in Lahore, Pakistan, and I came to the United States in 2003 when I got married. It was an arranged marriage. My husband was doing his fellowship at University of Michigan, and I had just done two years of college, and I moved to Michigan, which was my first home away from home. Before I got married, I had spoken to my mother-in-law. I actually didn't speak to my husband, uh, and uh, you know, this is how it happened with us. So I told her that I wanted to go to school after I got married and finish school. And she said, sure, we're very supportive of that. You know, you should have your college degree. And uh, I was like, okay. But I don't think she ever anticipated that I, my school wouldn't stop for a very long time. And I don't even think my husband anticipated that, but he was very supportive. Her work ethic is impeccable. Her dedication to her clients is admirable. She is an attorney who puts the interests and the wants of her clients at the foremost in any project that she works on. She is dedicated to making sure she contributes not only to the work that she does as a lawyer in her own practice, but also to the Las Vegas legal community. I think what worked out really well was that I ended up in Michigan in January and the snow was like six feet high and <laughs> my husband knew that she was gonna go crazy in an apartment waiting for me all day. So we signed up with a community college there, finished my undergrad in Michigan. Then we moved to Kansas with this job. I finished law school and I finished my graduate school in healthcare administration. And then once we had our green card and could move anywhere, we chose Las Vegas. And in between, I had two children. So my daughter is my undergrad baby and my son is my law school baby. Congratulations! We're so proud of you and uh, we love you very much and just wanted to say of how deserving you are of this award. You're the greatest mom ever, congratulations. You really deserve this and you're very inspirational to all of us in the family. Aisha, you're a rock star. You're the cornerstone of our family, the love of our life and such an inspirational person, being an attorney, mom, being a community leader and inspiration for all your students, colleagues, friends, and family. Us personally wanted to say that you are a perfect mother. We love you very much and we look up to you. Personally, I see you as my ideal model. I aspire to be like you when I grow up. And we just wanted to say that we, we love, love you. you. Congratulations. Congratulations. My goal has always been to find out what it means to be happy. So Aristotle said that happiness is living up to your fullest potential. And I truly believe that is true. It has been true for me because every time I feel that there's like a stop towards my development, I'm not a happy person. So I keep striving try and trying to improve. And it really is, life is you know a journey, not a destination. So it really is that journey of self-improvement. And I would encourage every young woman, every young person, to just not give up on their passions and their dreams and just take it one day at a time. So, you know, it's, you know, your goal is to reach there. It's not a sprint, it's a marathon. And I do encourage uh, young people to even try to participate in a marathon. I just completed one and it really is like life. You know, it's like one mile at a time, one step at a time, and next thing you know, you've completed 26.2 miles and you're surprised that you could do it. I definitely have something to boast about. My best friend is trendy, hardworking, loving, and compassionate, and no one competes with that. I love you and I'm so proud of you. Congratulations, Aisha. Pursue your passions, pursue, pursue your dreams, and uh, don't give up. That's the only thing. I just don't give up and stay strong. Um, have faith and you'll get there.